Hello learners. Welcome to another quick 5 minute update on current affairs. Today, we will focus on India's renewable energy needs, its goals, progress and way forward. Let's get started. This is going to be a topic of interest for years to come as India progresses on its renewable energy journey. This question featured in 2022 mains exam in JEE's paper 3. It is of an interdisciplinary nature. Rising population and income levels since 2000 have doubled the energy use in India. However, our per capita energy usage is still less than 40% of the world average. India draws almost 40% of its energy needs from coal and 25% from oil. In the last 10 years, most of the industrial expansion has been through coal. It also powers 80% of of electricity in India. All powers our transport, significantly increasing our imports. We import significant amount of oil, gas, and coal and are far from energy independence today. Imports have risen significantly in the last two decades. We are importing more and more as demands increase. India's energy demands will grow by 30% by 2030 and we have an ambitious goal of 50% share of renewables. This means we have to more than double our renewables capacity in the span of 7 to 8 years. The demand is expected to come from buildings, industry and transport sectors. Share of wind and solar in total capacity is steadily increasing and currently at 18%. India is a sunny country. We have 300 plus days of bright sunshine and this means a huge potential in solar. We currently have over 66.7 gigawatts of installed capacity and rank 4th globally in solar power generation. However, the subsidies equation continues to be discouraging. Fossil fuel subsidies are still 9 times of renewables. India must significantly step up clean energy subsidies to meet its targets. Here are some potential levers. 1 We need to increase our solar subsidies up to 4 times of current levels. 2. Solar energy needs better grid and battery infrastructure for effective distribution. 3. Rooftop solar is yet to be exploited. 4. 100% electrification of our vast railways infrastructure will have a significant impact. And lastly, 5. We have to discourage coal usage in industries. As always, here are some questions to set you thinking. Goals and plans are fine, but there are problems with execution. What do you think impedes India's path to clean energy goals? What are some other factors beyond subsidies that can help? What role does climate hypocrisy play in all this? Make your notes, your mind maps and explore this area. I am sure success will meet you. Now, try running a kilometer and clearing your mind. See you all next time.